How's it going, people? I already did a chapter, a section, but I see the next two are short, so I thought I would do them together. It's nothing to drink to, but I had one last red chair. So, let's polish her off. I think I'll do two sections in this video and call it a night. Section 47 of the DNC. Revelation given through Joseph Smith the prophet. In Kirtland, Ohio, March 8, 1831. Wow, he was busy that day. Prior to this time, Oliver Cowdery had acted as church historian and recorder. John Whitmere had not sought an appointment as historian, but being desired to serve in this capacity, had said that he would obey the will of the Lord in the matter. See History of the Church, Volume 1, page 166. John Whitmer, uh, designated as the Keeper of the History of the Church. <sighs> 1. Behold, it is expedient in me that my servant John should write and keep a regular history. Thank you. <laughs> and assist you, my servant Joseph, in transcribing all things which shall be given you until he is called to further duties. Two. Again, verily I say unto you that he can also lift up his voice in meetings, whenever it shall be expedient. Sounds conditional. Three. And again, I say unto you that it shall be appointed unto him to keep the church record. <laughs> what the hell, they're not writing on gold anymore. <sighs> and history continually. For Oliver Cowdery, I have appointed to another office. Sounds like some great management skills there. Four. Wherefore, it shall be given him, inasmuch as he is faithful, by the Comforter, to write these things. Even so, amen. And that's it for 47. Let's polish off 48. Revelation given through Joseph Smith the Prophet. At Kirtland, Ohio, March 1831. What day? Could it have been, oh, let's say, the 8th? <laughs> Maybe even me noticed this is a little bit much. <laughs> Sometime in March, all of a sudden they're not, they just, they don't have that knowledge anymore. Ah, what day was that? It was sometime in March. Joseph had inquired of the Lord as to the mode of procedure in procuring lands for the settlement of the saints 
this being an important matter in view of the migration of members of the church from New York, New York State in obedience to the Lord's command that they should assemble in Ohio. So that's a perfect decision, right? All right, write that down. They're in Ohio. That's where they were told to go. So everything should be fine, right? <laughs> we'll find out. <laughs> the people already established in Ohio to share their holdings with new arrivals, lands to be purchased as required, the people to follow the counsel of their presiding officers in the matter. So no bitching. <sighs> One. It is necessary that ye should remain for the present time in your places of abode as it shall be suitable to your circumstances. Two, and inasmuch as ye shall, as ye have lands, ye shall impart to the eastern brethren. Three, and inasmuch as ye have not lands, let them buy for the present time in those regions round about, as seemeth them good. For it must needs be necessary <laughs> that they have places to live for the present time. For it must needs be necessary that ye save all the money that ye can, that ye obtain all that ye can in righteousness, that in time ye may be enabled to purchase land for an inheritance, even the city. 5. The place is not yet to be revealed. Oh, okay. But after your brethren come from the east, there, there are to be certain men appointed, and to them it shall be given to know the place, for to them it shall be revealed. 6. And they shall be appointed to purchase, purchase lands, to make a commitment, commencement, to lay the foundation of the city. And then, and then shall ye <coughs> begin to be gathered with your families, every man according to his family, according to his circumstances. And as this, and, 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 and as is appointed to him by the presidency and the bishop of the church, according to the laws and commandments which ye have received, and which ye shall hereafter receive. Even so. Amen. And that's it for 47 and 48. And that's about all I can stand for one night. So I hope you learned something, and you're going to share it. Please. <laughs> Peace the fuck out. Have a wonderful, whatever the fuck it is you're having. Because, well, I want you to. I really do.